Hey students, this is a one mark question from topic of shallow foundations from subject of geotechnical engineering and in this question it is asked that in order of their decreasing performance which one of the following is a correct sequence. Now if we talk about raft foundation which we also call as mat foundation it is most suitable for poor strata where BC or bearing capacity of soil is very poor and water table is very near to ground surface. In that case we prefer mat footing and it is or uh, it tops the list in terms of shallow foundations in terms of performance. Hence raft foundations come first of all. Then if we talk about combined footings in case of two columns that are having very unevenly load that is say one column is carrying 2000 kilonewton and another column is carrying 200 kilonewton we may provide a combined footing for both the columns which help in sharing of loads sharing of loads and in such case we provide combined footing moreover combined footing is also provided in that case Suppose there are two columns which are situated at say 1.5 meter or 2 meter and size of isolated footing required for each column is say 2.5 meter into 2.5 meter. In that case it is not possible to provide individual isolated footings. Hence we provide a combined footing for both the columns such that in that space constraint footings for both the columns may be provided. Hence on second number comes combined footing and isolated footings they are preferred only in case when load on a single column is very very high and hence they are on priority 3 hence raft then combined and then isolated is the ranking of footings in terms of their performance making A as the best choice. Hence correct answer for given question is A. Thank you.